Today we're hauling one of my favorite affordable fashion brands. I feel like they offer so much fashion at such an affordable price. That's right, today we're hauling cider. Let's get into it. This is a color that everybody either loves or hates. I personally love it to death. Chartreuse. I mean, look at this one. Oh, it's giving like Jolly Green Giant if he was a princess. <laughs> So, um, love a good puff sleeve. You know that about me if you've been here for a while. And I just like this color. I also like really love common dresses and unusual colors because I think they instantly make a fashion statement without really going too far outside of what you're comfortable in. So wearing something like this in a chartreuse green, which is like a color you don't normally see a dress like this in, immediately feels more fashion just because you're choosing an unusual color. And I would probably put like a totally different color belt, maybe like a hat pink belt on this to even like bump up that like contrast and like kind of wow, wild and crazy color combo. Make it seem fashion. I feel like this dress has both made me feel great about myself and then also humbled me. First, let's talk about why I've been humbled. This thing does not fit. Uh, it is tight in a lot of different places, and I do feel like a big old can of biscuits is going to explode right out. But one of the places I feel it is tightest is on the chest. And I'm proud of these little guys, okay? <laughs> Sometimes it just feels nice to not have the flattest chest in the West. So whoever fit this dress had a smaller chest than me. And that is what I'm gonna take from this haul. I'm not competing with women. It's just usually I got the tiniest boobalas in the room. And today, that's not the case. I do not know what possessed me to put this in my cart. I clearly was not thinking, cause this is non-stretch. My thighs are concerned. I can hear them quaking in this skirt right now, <laughs> but we're gonna try it. We're gonna try new things. This is a non-stretch kind of like jumpsuit. It's just a jumpsuit with a cross, but I don't know, how do I get in? Oh, <laughs> that was the belt. So <laughs> there's a belt around the front, there's tie straps. It might work. Like. I just never know anymore. So it's always like a little bit of an adventure. Uh, I don't know how I feel about the fabric. I need to wear it in the warmth to see if I like it or not. But I do like the shape of this. I absolutely love that these are like jogger cuffs at the bottom. I think that is too cute. Humbled again. <laughs> I didn't like you anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna go try on something that fits. One thing I used to wear all the time that I noticed I haven't been wearing recently and I wanna change that is a good romper. And I saw this one because it's exactly like the leg, like big leg jumpsuits they have for fall, but they had this one in a little romper for summer. And I was like, look at all that thigh space. I have a lot of problems right now. I've talked about this before, but I'll say it again. My thighs are just not changing as fast as the rest of my body. So having something like this with all that leg room, so much space for activities. Maybe not the right place to use that, but I know I'm gonna be able to move and groove in this a lot better. And I'm super excited to try it. And I think it's really cute with this like little twist in the front. Plus it's rib knit fabric. So it's gonna be comfy as hell. I'm gonna keep this. This is so cute, right? This is super comfortable. It is super cute. Home run. I'm actually gonna keep my eye out to see if they make this in other colors because this is like perfect summer wear. And what I love about it especially is that I can actually still wear bike shorts underneath it. So I don't have to worry about chafing or if it comes up or anything, I'm good. Uh, so this is <laughs> this is winner winner chicken dinner. This makes up for all the humbling I had to go through in this haul. <sighs> Too much humbling. I have been humbled. And now I look fabulous again. <laughs> So this is a cute like little corset style dress in the front. I'm gonna be real with you. I do not love the fabric of this one. This fabric, this is the fabric I hate for summer. It's kind of that weird swishy, it feels cheap. It feels cheap. I'm gonna try it on. Maybe I'll change my mind. There's this hair again. <gasps> I just pulled it out. Okay, that was not expected. <laughs> I will give it a fair chance, but I am not confident I will like this. I just don't. I'm not enjoying how it feels just touching it. Um, yeah, we'll see. Does it have pockets? See, this to me is a miss. A dress like this should always have pockets, right? Tell me if I'm wrong, but this feels like a dress that could easily have pockets and it doesn't. And that, my friends, is not fair. 
Once I put this dress on, I realized what an idiot I'd been because this dress is fantastic. The fabric also doesn't bother me once it's on. It feels actually kind of nice. So I'm, <laughs> I'm like a little like confused, but I'm not going to complain because I think I look great. <laughs> and this is something I could wear all day. Put some bike shorts underneath. Nobody would know. I'd look fantastic. I'd feel fantastic. Win, 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 win. All I do is win, 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 no matter what. <laughs> I love it. I, I literally love this. I bought two of these. I didn't mean to buy two of these, but I did buy two of them, but just in different colors. So the first is this like ditzy floral Western skirt. You can see the rickrack here and around the tiers. I am in a little bit of a Western phase right now, and this felt decidedly Western and like easy to kind of style up. I just got some new boots, so I can totally see like wearing this with my cute little booties. Um, a little cowboy hat and living my best Austin life. With it, I got this handkerchief crop top. I don't know if I love this. I don't know if I love this together, but we're gonna try it. I do love that it has kind of like a crochet-y feel. It does feel like it might be not tight enough to like stay up on its own. So that's that's something we'll deal with when we get there, but I this actually might be a really cute vibe. You know what it makes me feel like? It makes me feel like I need to put a scarf in my hair. Is that coming back? Remember like the half scarfs we used to wear in the 90s when Delia's was everybody's fashion inspo? I think it is coming back. Yeah, I think I'm just, we're just returning to the late 90s, guys. I'm just gonna go back home. That's what I feel like. But uh, this may look cute, this may not work, we'll see. Along those lines of working or not working, the next skirt that's very similar to that skirt and the top I chose may or may not work as well. The top is a big no, it is too big. I am nervous about it falling down, so we're just gonna stay like this. The skirt is a big yes. So winner, not a winner. <laughs> yeah, you know, this is life. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. So the skirt, again, will look very familiar because it's almost like a slightly yellow version of that skirt, except here we have more of a pointel lace detail on the skirts. I actually kind of like this one a bit more. The fabric on this one, way better. This is more of a cotton. That was definitely a polyester. And I, I just genuinely like the color a lot. So this to me is the better of the two skirts. And if I had to pick one, I would pick the yellow one. Now with it, what I've picked, and again, this may not work at all, but in my mind, my mind, it was like, it has potential. So I love that Eclectic Grandpa is like a style right now. And I thought it might be fun to just get a little crazy. <laughs> I'm looking at this and I go, Anna, sometimes I trust you and sometimes I don't. And that's me trusting myself, guys. I don't know if I trust myself on this one, but this is why fashion is fun because we get to try new things and we get to see if they work out and maybe this will work out and maybe it won't and it doesn't matter because it's just close at the end of the day i get to choose what i put on my body and if i don't like it i just won't wear it that way i'm sure i can find something else that's super cute in my closet that will work better if this doesn't work and that's the beauty of style i didn't know if i would like the vibe but i actually do but the skirt is a little off for me. It's a little tight in the hips. Like I want it to sit here. So I have this cute like little, little peek through, but it's a little too tight in the hips. So I do have to kind of pull it up a little, which I think ruins the cuteness of the combo. But the two together look better than I thought they would. I don't know if I love it, but I definitely don't hate it. It's better than I thought. Oh, and I'm 100% keeping the top. The top is so cute. It's probably of the two things, my favorite. And I thought I was gonna be obsessed with the skirt. Nope. So that is everything in my cider haul. Kept it short and sweet for you guys today. Honestly, cider is such a great place to get affordable things. This is not sponsored. I'm not getting any money from cider. I just regularly see things that I don't see on other sites available on cider. Um, with that, links to everything are down below. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me today, guys. I will check you later. And as I always say, and I genuinely hope, peace like just in your day, in your life, and in the world in general.